Angeles is on fire. All right. I'll send a man down. Hello. What? A car parked on the wrong side of the street. Did you ring? Yes. Call out the reserves, will you? Reserves. And then she says, I love you, Reginald. Reginald. Yeah. You're sure not. Did you hear about the jewel robbery at the ball last night? Oh, go on away. I'm writing one of them there scenarios. Yeah, now, just a minute, you great big flat-footed cop. You better listen to me. Somebody stole Norma Shearer's jewels. Well, what of it? Well, they stole them from us. Why, the dirty crooks. Inspector Kane speaking. What? I'll get right over with two of my best men. Were they there? 
Oh, I can wait for the answer. Go on back and find out. Yes, ma'am. What? Yes, sir. Uh, Excuse me, please. I forgot to wait for the answer. Say, listen. If you don't get out of here, I'll send you back to Poland in a pine box. No, not Poland. Sweden. All right, Sweden. Oh, thank you very much. Well, what did he say? Oh, he's a nice fella. He's going to send me to Sweden. Come on with me. Mr. McLaughlin, can I talk to you? What is it? Norma Shearer's jewels were stolen last night. Do you know anything about them? Are you insinuating that I took them? No, I'm only asking you. Oh, now you see what you've done. He won't send me back to Sweden. Oh, yes, he will. Uh, you ought to be ashamed of yourself, any little Norwegian like that. Say it, you. Says me. Excuse me, gentlemen. I'm not from Norway. Sweden. That picture should be over on the left. No, it should be over on the right. Is that so? Yes, and so are you. I want to see Winnie Lightner. 807. Thank you. How did you know she was an 807? Oh, who are you? I'm a detective. No, you're not. 
You won't do. You don't look a bit like a detective. Come on, Sue. Wait up.
Come on, take them off. I know you. Come on, take them off. No. Take them off, I tell you. No, I won't take mine off unless you take yours off first. Oh, yes, you will. Oh, no, I won't. So it's you, is it? Were you present when those jewels were stolen? Yes. What? Uh, no, no, no. How do I know? Well, because if I was there, I'd have hollered for help. How loud can you holler for help? How loud? Yes. Thank you. And the moral of this story is never spank a child on an empty stomach. 